Hello everyone, welcome back to Try Your Logic. Today I'm here to show you how to square a number. Now you all will think what is squaring a number means. Squaring means nothing. Squaring a number means you just have to double that number. Am I clear? So what you have to do, whatever number will be given to you, you just have to double it. For example, if I give you 24, so squaring of 24 means 24 into 24. Clear? So we will discuss this one in today's video. So let us start without wasting any time. So first we will take any double digit number. So let me take 24 as I told you. So what I will do? Will I multiply 24 into 25? 24? No. That will be a long process. So let us learn some shortcut. What is the shortcut? So whenever you square a double digit number, always remember take three dash. And each dash, you have to take double digit number. Double digit you have to keep it. So four square, 16. So yes, correct, we have double digit. Two square is four. So it's not double digit. To make it double digit, we have to add one zero. Okay, now what will be the center, the middle number? Very easy. What you will do, two into four is eight. Eight into two is 16. So yes, double digit. Now, our final answer will be, you will take the last digit as it is. This one, you add it with six. So it will be seven. This one, you add it with one, uh, four. So one plus four, that is five. So here is our answer. I hope it is very easy to do. You all will understand. I will show you a few more examples. Okay, now I will take 76 square. So what I will do, 76 square, same way. First you square six. Squaring six means six into six, that is 36. Yes, we got double digit. So no need of adding zero. Seven square is 49. And the center one, what it will be? Seven into six, that is 42. 42 into two is 84. Now what you have to do? Six, you write down as it is. Three plus four is seven. Eight plus nine is 17. So you write seven and take carry one here. So four plus one, five. So your, your answer is five. Double seven six. So square of seventy six is five seven seven six. One more example. I'll show you. Twenty one square. But here one square is one. Two square is four. We are not getting double digit. So what we have to do? Add one zero. Please don't add the zero. Don't add zero after one. You have to add zero before one. Similarly, you have to add zero before four. And what will be our center digit? Two into one is two, two into two is four. But see, here also single digit, so we will add zero here. Now same way, we will take the last one as it is. Zero plus four is four, zero plus four is four, and zero no need of writing. So your answer is 441. So square of 21 is 441. Now, I will show you a few examples of five, like 65 square. In my previous video, if you have seen, you will see whenever there is five in one's place, the squaring of a number becomes very easy. How easy? What you have to do, you don't have to use the process I taught you right now. Just you do five square is 25 and six into the next number, seven. So six into seven, 42. So that's your answer. One more example, 25 square. What you will do? Five square is 25 and two into the next number, two into three, that is six. So your answer is 625. So five, whenever there is five, the answer becomes very easy to do. So let me show you one more number, 12 square. Two square is four. So we will write down zero four, one square is zero one, one into two, two, two into two, four. So zero four. So your answer will be four, 
four, one. So one forty-four is your answer. So that's all for today. Please go through the full video, and in my next video, I will show you how to square two-digit number. Okay, but the center number will be zero. For example, five zero nine square, one zero one square. So this all squaring of three-digit number. I will show you in my next video. Keep following my channel and subscribe. Drive your logic. Thanks for watching my video. Have a great day.